people don't ever think about exercising their mind or giving their mind no. that break, but you, you kind of need to do that, don't you? Absolutely. I mean, we brush our teeth every day, but yet we don't do anything to, to clean our minds, and mm. it's important that we do that every day. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So how does uh, school contact you? You work with, with schools and kids, and they're often stressed out and have a lot going on. How, how can a school get in touch with you? Absolutely. Um, they can just go to my uh, website or uh, my email. I don't know if you'll be putting that up uh, at some point, mm -hmm. but I'm actually in a school. It's more um, launching what's called the Time Out Mindfulness uh, Project, and over 250 uh, students and teachers will partake in um, a bunch of mindfulness techniques, and so I'm excited about that, but it's the easiest way is my website or just to um, email, email me as well. Okay. Now, mindfulness techniques, we talked about connecting with breathing. What else What else can people do? Um, people can do, like one of the things I'm going to have the kids do tomorrow is uh, I'm going to challenge them for 40 consecutive days that they say or do something nice for somebody else. Hmm. So mindfulness isn't just necessarily going into yourself, into your own space and keeping to yourself, but I think it's also very important that we're mindful of what we say of what we do we bring it into our everyday lives and we're very very present mm -hmm. that's very being present